The former Georgian foreign minister says the United States could be partly responsible for the violence in South Ossetia. In an interview to the France Press news agency, Salom Zorabishvili commented on the possible reasons behind the military conflict. There are many Americans in Georgia training the military forces of the country and monitoring the situation. As I understand, they also supervise the strategic corridor, the bakut bilisi shihan oil pipeline. The main purpose behind the conflict is further strategic orientation of Georgia and an opportunity for the West, I mean the USA and the EU, to count on Georgia and the Caucasus in ensuring the strategic provision of oil. Now, who stands for military escalation in the conflict zone? Professor Gerhard Mangert from the Department of Political Science at the University of Innsbruck talked to us and shared his opinion. Some observers argue that actually no side had wanted a military escalation, but uh, given all the tensions of the past months, the situation simply got out, con got out of control. Actually, I don't believe in that explanation. I think that the military assault on South Ossetia was launched deliberately. And the question then is by whom? Well, definitely not by Russia, as it is uh, by all means not in Russia's interest to change the status quo because Russia had any leverage on Georgia and the Caucasus it had wanted with the previous situation. I do think that Saakashvili uh, launched that military escalation. We know him as a hot-headed, firebrand Georgian nationalist who, at the very start of his presidency, vowed to unite Georgia. And it seems that uh, given that uh, the Bush presidency in uh, the United States is in its final months, he he realized that he has only a small window of opportunity to reunite Georgia and South Ossetia by military means. He does have a well-trained military at the moment. It has been well-trained by, by the United States, by military advisors since 2002. It has been armed by the U.S. and uh, the, the armed forces of Georgia have uh, military um, experience fighting experience because they had a lot of soldiers in Iraq. So I think he decided to use a brinkmanship strategy, uh, go for it, and he underestimated Russian resolve to retaliate.